dramatic video shown to a jury, the video capturing the terrifying moments that Sergeant Jovi Sepulveda was shot in the neck. It happened back in February of 2021, and since then, Wilfredo Montemayor has been charged and pleaded guilty to attempted capital murder. The jury is now deciding his punishment. In the courtroom today, they saw that graphic footage of officers and residents trying to save that officer's life. Erica Hernandez with the video that we warn may be hard to watch. Help! Help! Help me, please! Former Balcony Heights officer Edgar Ortiz telling a jury what happened the moments he dove up to the scene after Sergeant Joey Sepulveda was shot in the neck. It all happened so fast, it was kind of jumbled. But I remember the car was driving, I remember it firing around, and I remember going to Joey Sepulveda's aid as soon as the car had left. Sepulveda was called to the sole apartments in the 6900 block of Interstate 10 to investigate after Wilfredo Montemayor and his brother, Sigifredo Montemayor, were seen burglarizing cars. In Ortiz's body cam footage, you see the moments he fires one shot at the vehicle the Montemayor brothers were in and then begin to check on Sepulveda. He gets help dragging him to a police unit and drives to the hospital that was just a couple minutes away. Papa, how are you doing, man? Did you think Sepulveda was going to die that day? I did. Oh, God. It's hard to be with me. Sepulveda was shot several times, including the shoulder and in his neck, but did survive. Sigifredo Montemayor was captured in Mexico days after the shooting, and Wilfredo Montemayor arrested a day after his brother. Wilfredo has admitted guilt, but now awaits his punishment. Now, the jury will decide on punishment tomorrow. That range of punishment can be five to 99 years or life in prison. As for Montemayor's brother, he awaits for a later trial date. At the Cadenarius Justice Center, Erica Hernandez, KSAT 12 News. Thank you for watching KSAT 12. If you are on YouTube, you can like and subscribe so you can stay up to date on all the latest news and weather here in San Antonio.